Hello, my name's Ruth. If, like me, you have trouble learning your multiplication tables, you might like to try the Gypsy or Romany tables method. It takes about two minutes to learn and it can help you to be certain of tables between 6 times 6 and 10 times 10. This is how it works. First of all, you have to learn which fingers represent which multiplication tables. So if you could do this with me, that'd be great. Sixes, sevens, eights, nines, tens. And again, sixes, sevens, eights, nines, tens. And once more for luck. Sixes, sevens, eights, nines, tens. Let's pretend we've been given a difficult multiplication sum and it's seven times seven. Well, difficult for me anyway. We get our seven finger and our seven finger. Six is seven, six, nine, ten, yes. Seven times seven. Stick them together, make an arch. Every finger that's part of that arch is worth ten. Ten, twenty, thirty, forty. We can be sure the answer is forty something. We see what we have left over. Three, lots of three. Three, six, nine. Nine. Answer, forty-nine. Seven sevens, without a shadow of a doubt, are forty-nine. Just for clarification, I'll work with 7 times 8 for you. 7 times 8. Stick my fingers together, make an arch. Every finger that's part of that arch is worth 10, and there are 5 of them. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. See what we have left? 2, lots of 3. 2 times 3 is 6. Answer, 10, 20, 30, 40, 56. 56. So without a shadow of a doubt, 7 times 8 is 56. This will work for 8 times 8, 9 times 9, 10 times 10. Just try it. If you had a row of fingers, you could carry on forever. Thank you.